guys, welcome back to my channel. Hi guys. Guess who's here again? <laughs> Kinesia. Period. My good sis. <laughs> so we're at the mall. We're getting last minute. I don't know why we decided to come to the mall during the Christmas time. But let's hope and pray. Even though out here looks pretty busy. Like it's packed out here. Yeah, it really a lot. is. So, it's the holiday season. So. Right. So we'll see how that goes. I don't even know if I want to even step foot in Bath and Body Works to be honest. It's going to be so Because I know it's going to yeah, be packed. Gonna be so Especially if they have sales still going on. But I didn't get a gift for one of my favorite people. Ooh, he scared me. I didn't get a gift for one of my favorite people. So I need to get on that. But yeah, so I'm going to take y'all with me and show y'all what's going on. So yeah, see you later. In the mall, Epic Fail is so busy in here. And I thought I was going to go to Bath and Body Works, but it's so much people in here to the point where they're walking against like the flow of regular traffic in the mall. Like that's how packed it is. They just do what the heck they want to do at this point. They got lines, like they're controlling the lines of people outside. Like what even this COVID infested so the line for Pandora starts over here and the store is over there. Boy, that's crazy. This is what we get for coming to the mall during the week of Christmas. Like, what do we think? What do we expect? Yeah, exactly. Like, what the heck? That's true because people are getting off work and coming straight here. Um, y'all, zero out of 10 recommend y'all do this last minute shopping for real. Don't recommend. Ooh, I should check out some shoes, but yeah, I think I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna go to Foot Locker real quick and see if they have any ones no at shoes. least. You said no shoes. Is it a line? It's a no for me. Jesus. It's a line literally for every good store. If we can't stop shopping the stores that we wanna shop, then what can we do? We gotta go to Dillard. Okay. Are we going the right direction? And there's people in here with no mask on, y'all. The anxiety in me. How was I acting, Kanisha, when I seen that they had no mask? Crazy, you was about to spaz. I was literally about to spaz, because they just walking like normally with no mask on, like proudly too, like, what's good? No mask, no mask, no freaking mask. Anxiety in me is thriving right now. Freaking thriving. But anyways, yeah, when we get to the store, I'll let y'all know. What's going on? I'll update y'all. So later. But hey guys, we're gonna try this again and try to go to um, Bath and Body Works. Is there a line long? Jesus, y'all look how much people is in here. I'm not exaggerating. I'm dramatic, but I ain't that dramatic. But look how long the line is for Bath and Body Works. Outside the door and they're doing line control. The ghetto. Towards me, and I'm just like, yeet. <laughs> do you want to go try them or you want to try somewhere else real quick? Because I wonder if it's going to get longer the longer we wait. It's up to you. You want to? <laughs> but I think they're moving pretty fast though. So we made it in the line, you guys. And it's, it's not that much people in front of us, but it's still a line outside of the store at this point because the Are store you is over. Right there the, the store is over there, and we're standing over here <laughs> so yeah we got a, quite some time to kill while we're here but i'll let y'all know when we finally make it into the store it's so much people in here okay y'all so we made it we got food of course we couldn't <laughs> walk out of there you got to eat <laughs> it's so automatic that's why <laughs> it is i just got in the car so my instinct is to put my seatbelt on that's good though love yeah, that yeah. for you so safety first mm -hmm. i remember when i recorded a video on snapchat and i didn't have my seatbelt on you told me to put my seatbelt on you remember oh, yeah <laughs> yeah i thought you had it on i thought you were gonna say i have it on it's just in the back in your back nope i didn't have but, it on at all so we got chick-fil-a um i got a large fry a small peppermint milkshake that i've never tried before so 
y'all will, will hear it here first if I like it or not. And then I got a vanilla milkshake and a chicken sandwich and some fries with the barbecue sauce. Mm -hmm. Heavy on the barbecue. Ew. <laughs> and I got a large kale salad because you got to have balance. You got to have balance. <laughs> I'm eating the milkshake. And... But that sriracha sauce, how do you not like sweet, spicy sriracha? Uh. Barbecue is so boring and basic. Yes. I mean, you like what you like, but barbecue is just so casual. You can eat that anytime. How do you go to Chick fil A and eat barbecue sauce? <laughs> I know, that's we really not the norm. Sweet, so. I'm not my Let me lock these doors because. I'm not my No, because then they're going to think you're leaving. Oh, okay. You can wind down the window, though. That's crazy that he's right here next to us. He probably got scared, like, what the heck? <laughs> Lord, bless this food before we take part in it. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. Amen. I love that you try to eat. Like, you don't miss one meal. Man. I almost just forgot. But Lord knows my heart. This, you have to try it, Kinesia. Mm -mm. I'll pass. You don't like spicy, though. I How don't. Do you... I don't like spicy stuff. How do she's so like over me. Right, like, 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 how do you not like spicy? Mm -hmm. I, literally, I add cayenne pepper to everything that I eat. I make sure these doors lock, right? I'm paranoid. I'm sorry mm -hmm. if I'm bringing my anxiety on you. It's cool, but when my doors are unlocked, it looks like that. Mm -hmm. And when I lock, it's like that. Well, if you're hot, we can wind on the window. Yeah, that's know? what I was just about to do. Mm -hmm. Yo, so good. But you turn the car on? Because I, I don't think you're leaving, but it's a parking space right next to us. I have to turn on the, oh, to the rolling. Door. We're not all the way on. You can turn it on like this. Mm -mm. mm -hmm. It's not gonna work. Look. Oh. You know what? I'm done. I knew that. I told you. I told you it worked. I was like, maybe she knows about more than me because um this good All my feet? life, yes. Yeah, all my life, I've tried that when I turned the car on and it's worked. Y'all, I told her it was gonna work. She didn't listen to me. It's cool. <laughs> You never know until you know. Mm. I love that car in front of us. That's a nice the Mustang. Car. Mm -hmm. Them things are so loud though. You can't sneak out nowhere with that car. Girl, <laughs> they gonna tell your business. Oh, she leaving the house. <laughs> you wanna go be like, Kanisa, where are you going? Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna be like, last time I checked, I'll be 21 in. Ooh. And she gonna <laughs> pop you right in the mouth. <laughs> 21 pops. <laughs> 21 pops in the mouth. <laughs> Just kidding. No, no, nah, but my mama's cool though. She is. She sounds really chill. But I know when my my kids come around. Oh baby, we gonna be thick as thieves, girl. And that um, that actually relates to the video, the um the video that was posted on Sunday with Pastor Mike. Oh, mm -hmm. um, what was the service on Sunday? When he was telling, he was telling us, um, I forgot to say him, but basically he was saying, what, you um, have to oh, heal. what you don't, trend, um, what you don't, um, transform will transfer. Yeah, that's what it was. Mm -hmm. Girl, that word hit different for real. Mm -hmm. Is she okay? I thought she was crying. I was about to say, Lord have mercy. Bless the Lord. It's crazy because I found myself like, instead of like judging people now, I'd be praying for them. That's good. Like, you know how... You'll see somebody doing something weird and you just like, ugh, and then you just walk away or mm -hmm. like you just stand offish towards them. I'll be praying for them because I'll be feeling like, dang, I don't know what they're going through. Mm -hmm. Even like homeless people that look like they're doing just like stuff that you're like, you would want to give them money, but you don't think you don't know what they're going to do with the money. Yeah. Like they can go buy. Beer, right. Like, exactly. Mm hmm. Some seeds. Girl. Just pay for them. That's I'm, better than anything you could give them. You're right. Mm -hmm. And I'll never forget. I was in Walmart and I went right before my job. Mm -hmm. And all I wanted was some freaking cocoa butter. So, oh, yeah, you told me that. I did. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that still bothers me to this day. Like, but she was really rude. Yeah, like, you doing all that. Put me in a bad mood before work. Like, mm -hmm. yeah. But, she, like you said, I don't know what she was going through. Maybe it was mm -hmm. a rough morning for her. Mm hmm. You never know until you know, man. And my grandma actually told me that. She was like, don't worry about it. You never know what people are going through. But right. she's real big on, like, God, too. Mm hmm So. Mm hmm mm hmm What's going on? 
He was looking, so I'm looking. Shoot. <laughs> you be well aware. That's good. Girl, because you, you, nowadays you can't put nothing past mm -hmm. nothing. Like, because it's just like, they be so sporadic with it. You don't want to be like clueless when stuff is going on. Exactly. I was sitting there talking to you, and this is you. <laughs> <laughs> well aware. I like it. I'm the same way though. Mm -mm, mm -mm. I don't want to be in a mix of no crossfire, clueless, and then boom, my life gone. Mm -hmm. It's really good to be like that. Mm -hmm. I realized I was like that in our last YouTube video, just looking around. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe it's Christmas time. Like, what the heck? How did that? How did we get here that quick? I can't believe it's about to be 2021. Where's my straw? I know I had it, but where did I put it? Oh. But yeah, I went in Bath and Body Works, y'all. First of all, let me tell y'all about the security guard that tried to tell me I couldn't film in the mall. Like, <laughs> people still doing that? Oh my God. That's crazy that people, I'm guessing it's a safety precaution just so it's not, like, it doesn't start like um, feuds or fights or whatever. Mm -hmm. But still, like, do you not know the day and age that we're in? People film and the fights that they have in the mall, people record it. So I'm just like, what? I thought you'd be more worried about if people are stealing or whatever the case may be. But this exactly. man came up to me and said, you can't record in here, miss. Or people are not wearing masks. Because clearly he don't care about that. It was so many people not Crowds of people <laughs> literally walking, just carefree, no mask. I was literally. just like, the anxiety. Mm-mm. Okay, this is kind of fire. I didn't even say nothing. That's how you know it's good when you can't even talk. <laughs> Go ahead, say it. 10 I out of 10, recommend. <laughs> Period. Say it again, sis. 10, 10 out, out of 10, 10. recommend. <laughs> I wish you would have got it, but you do say you like vanilla. And I don't like, I don't want you to get it and you don't like it. Oh, uh, yeah, I would have felt some mm. type way. They did something. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I told sir. myself that. I was gonna start trying them stuff though, so I should have tried it. This milkshake, baby girl. <laughs> Ain't nothing to play with. It's that good, you gotta post mm -hmm. it. <laughs> they shouldn't make it just seasonal then, you know? <laughs> but that's how they um get like I'm not even supposed to be drinking this, though. My tore, stomach gonna be tore the hell up. How long would it take what? for your stomach to get tore up after you drink it? I don't gotta use the bathroom, it's just gonna be like, right. Sis, why did you drink that? I feel bad. I why? Want I wanted to drink it! <laughs> I don't want you to feel like that, though. No, it doesn't hurt instantly, though. Okay. It takes a while. It doesn't even hurt, it just like, yeah, at the, at the end of the day, bathroom run is gonna be a definitely. Mm -hmm. You see y'all, I care. <laughs> it's her for me. <laughs> this food is good. Mm. There's not one time Chick-fil-A is just not good. Even though Never. my fries could have been a little bit crispier, but that's just because of my preference. I really mm -hmm. like crispy fries. But y'all, this right here. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> Her hair color was nice. Mm -hmm. I was looking at it. Would you ever dye your hair again? I never dyed it in the first place. For real? Never ever in my life. Don't do it. Why? Because that's how you um can damage your hair. I understand that, but... And it stops how fast it will grow. Really? Mm -hmm. Did you have to bleach it then when you dyed it? Mm-hmm. Then? Because mm -hmm. mm -hmm. my um, remember I told you my cousin, she's a hairstylist, so mm -hmm. she was telling me I don't know if it's because my hair was relaxed, but she said it will somewhat take a toll on it if I don't keep it healthy. Yeah, it's a lot. It's high maintenance after you dye your hair mm -hmm. because you have to make sure it's moisturized, more frequent or not more frequent. You have to moisturize it often because the chemicals that it's used to bleach it and stuff like that literally strips your hair. So you have to make sure that you're heavy on the moisturizer in your hair. So, yep, so one wrong move. Like, mm -hmm. Remember I told you I had heat damage? I really feel like 
I wouldn't have had to cut my hair as short as, as short as it was if mm -hmm. my hair was um not dyed. Cause she told me I had to cut all of the dyed hair off. But you grew it out, didn't you? Mm -hmm. She well, she cut it off and then it grew. Cut it, cut it, cut it. Mm -hmm. But now I'm good. I'm good now, but before y'all sweet baby jesus <laughs> mm -mm 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 -mm. their kale salads if you ever like want to try a salad a quick little salad chick-fil-a will get you right can they do no wrong though i'm weak <laughs> can chick-fil-a do no wrong though no mm -hmm. <laughs> anywho I don't know if my aunt's gonna watch this video. She probably won't. But I got her this orange and ginger um, moisturizing cream from Bath and Body Works. It smells amazing. Like anything ginger, she loves. So hopefully she likes it. But she's real picky with Sims. That's why I try to pick stuff that I know that she likes. Mm -hmm. Cause I don't want to get you something that you're not gonna use mm -hmm. or you're gonna re-gift. So, but. Then I got her this um, stress relief eucalyptus and spearmint moisturizing body cream. Smells fresh and clean. I have the hand sanitizer. This it smells really good. Then I got her the matching body wash for that. Oh, remind me to get um, from Five Below. Remind me to get the gift bag so I can put this in. Okay, I think I have wrapping paper. Not wrapping paper. Um, I think I have what's it called? I really thought I got three of these, honestly, but they're seven fifty each. Child, that about to be works be knowing. So I got these two for me as well. These two lip glosses, cause I heard they slap. I used to get them when they were in the little tubes, the smaller tubes. This one here too. The sun, the lighting is going down, but it's okay. But these um, I heard they're clutch, and they're minty. Keep keep the breath. Fresh while you keeping your lips popping. Okay, take two. <laughs> that was take two. A freaking week. But yeah, you don't want your breath to be stained. Right. <laughs> mm. She thinks she's slick trying to eat over here in the corner. That's all that is. <laughs> we see you, sis. We see you. Tell <laughs> her what you eating, by the way. A chicken sandwich. As Brett would say, 10 out of 10 recommend. No, for real. <laughs> if I was to ever go back to eat meat, I would only eat Chick fil A chicken. Really? I would never eat nothing else. I want to low key try the Popeyes chicken sandwich. Have you tried it? No. I just want to try it just for all time's sake. I want to try All time? It Isn't it old time's sake? I'm I tripping. Have no idea. Boy. All I, I know is I want to try it. Mm -hmm. I really do. Because people went crazy over it. Like the lines were long. I heard, I heard people, people die. die. Yes. People die. Get out of my head, please. <laughs> people was fighting over it. Mm. Like, is that good? Y'all, somebody, not somebody, Natural Sunny on YouTube made s'mores with Reese's pieces instead of like Hershey Kisses. And we it really want to so do it. so good. And mm -hmm. I'm about to try to see if we can recreate it because it looks so good and maybe watch a movie a christmas movie mm -hmm. mm. that'd be lit it looks so good it's the body yaddy yaddy for me <laughs> she got a nice body so everybody what do you feel when people getting their body done how do you feel i mean no shade or anything to anyone who wants to get their body done. Mm -hmm. They have their own reasons. Me personally, I feel like natural is better. And if you want a certain look, mm -hmm. you can always work out. And right. Get that certain look. I mean, it might not be the exact same, but it's natural, you know? Because a lot of people, they say that that's why they get their body done because they tried working out and stuff like that. And it, um, it didn't work. They were just saying that it didn't even give them the, the desired look like they still was having like the body wasn't changing as fast or it didn't change to what they thought it would. When you so say get your like, body done, I automatically assume like a butt. <laughs> maybe a, yeah, it was her butt that she got done. And my kale salad, y'all. I'm not even that hungry. I'm just because that milkshake kind of filled me up in the fries. But I just wanted to taste it real quick. You love kale because I just remembered the pizza that you had. Mm. Like, 
<laughs> Is it kale or spinach? Oh, I think it's spinach. Oh, well, I just like my greens, period. <laughs> More of the story. <laughs> right. You have to, though. Your body needs it. Well, what was I saying? Um, like body getting your body done? Mm -hmm. And how they don't get the desired look. Right, so they feel like they're forced to, um, they're forced to having to go to cosmetic surgery. Mm -hmm. That stuff ain't cheap though. At all. In it's the recovery, the recovery time, you have to be down, not working, not doing anything because you can't do too much because your body's having to recover. You can't stress mm -hmm. it out even more because you've done so much already. Mm -hmm. Yep. I mean, all power to those that can do that and have the money to do it. All power to y'all. I'm just scary. So, because if I didn't have to work out, oh baby, I'd be Dr. Miami. <laughs> but he'd be booked, girl. I got years out in advance. Mm -hmm. Like if you was to try to book an appointment right now, it'd probably be like two years out. That's because everybody mean. wants. Yeah, everybody wants to, him to do it for them. So how do you feel about having like anything done on your face? nose job lip as long as it's for the right reasons and you're not doing it to please other people mm -hmm. i feel like by all means because if it's an insecurity about yourself and you have the money or the monetary resources to change it mm -hmm. then all, by all means but they always do a, like a psych evaluation before to make sure that you have the right intentions like you're not just doing it just because people's been talking about it or mm -hmm. people bring it up to you or whatever things maybe it's because you genuinely yeah. want it done for yourself that's why i'm glad that they do that mm -hmm. even though there's still people that can pass the evaluation and they do it for insecure reasons because there's this i don't know if you watch botch but this um guy like got like so many surgeries done to his body or he wanted to look like a ken doll basically exactly like carbon copy of a ken doll Wow. Mm-hmm. So each of Mm-hmm. And none of my business. Mm -hmm. But it's just like be careful out here because you can't just be going to any and anybody to any and everybody to do your surgery because mm -hmm. <clears throat> that's that, your life that you're putting in jeopardy, right. man. And another thing is once it's done, it's done. Like you don't wanna have any regrets, you know? Mm-hmm. So And sometimes it's not reversible. Yep. It's a permanent decision, man. But thanks for coming to our TED Talk. <laughs> oh my god. The party. <laughs> the TED Talk. No. Not for real. But yeah, it's getting mad dark. So we'll probably have to talk to y'all later. Mm -hmm. But that's just our little mukbang little vibes with Chick fil A as per usual. Mm -hmm. Um. So yeah, we'll talk to y'all later. Bye. Bye.